Hi, this is PC Roger, and I just wanted to use this latest scam that uh, I received in my inbox that uh, really isn't necessarily new. I think it's been around a while, but maybe it's resurfacing or somebody's just kind of rolling it out again. But what I wanted to demonstrate is how you can use at least an Outlook, uh, just a simple technique to determine that it is not authentic and that it is a scam and should not be opened. Uh, before you even open it. And there are times that you uh, don't want to open an email that's a scam simply because it, it uh, may contain some type of uh, tracking pixel or something to let them know that there's a real person and a real email address on the other end. Because a lot of times they just send out to every random address they can possibly come up with and whatever they get uh, any kind of feedback from through like a tracking pixel or something tells them that you're there and that you do open emails and then you'll get more. So, uh, and, and also just to limit any possible, uh, uh, you know, accidental clicks or whatever that could uh, uh, initiate a malware attack on your machine. So here, uh, this is just a screenshot of Outlook, and I'm working with screenshots just to uh, save me the trouble blurring out a lot of stuff. So if you uh, just kind of put your cursor over the subject, right click, there will be an option to come up for uh, a message options, and that should look like this. And here in the message options, you can see if you kind of scroll down, it doesn't always look exactly the same in this internet headers area, but somewhere you should see, like in this case it says, received from nationwidemedical.com. I mean, really? Uh, send mail at Nationwide Medical. Do you think PayPal uses a nationwidemedical.com server to send out their email? Hmm, don't think so. Probably more likely that Nationwide Medical you know, may very well be legitimate, but perhaps someone's hacked their server unfortunately set up as an open relay by someone that doesn't know better or whatever and uh, they are able to you know, relay their messages from them to uh, to kind of hide their tracks or maybe uh, mask the fact that they're coming from Russia or China or wherever. But if you look really closely in this from, you know, they've got it in here that they're trying to make it look right. It says from PayPal, service at paypal.com. Whoops, wait a minute. If you look closely, there's one too many L's in paypal.com. And that is another uh, indicator that, that this is garbage. This is a, probably a malware attack. So you really don't need no, to go any farther in, uh, in Outlook. You would just hold down the Shift key and click the X for Delete. And that actually bypasses the Recycle Bin. And just get rid of this thing. Now, since uh, I have a little bit more obligation to check things out, I went a little further, carefully. And I open the email, and it doesn't look like they have any tracking pixels or anything, but you know, I, I didn't really examine it that much uh, to, to find out for sure. I just kind of looked at uh, some of the things here to show you how you can just know for sure that, th that this is a scam. Now here at the top, if you uh, what I've done is I've hovered over, and I, I apologize, I've got you know, so many boxes going on here, but there was a link to log into PayPal, and that's what they want you to do. But if you just kind of hover over that link, Outlook will show you where that link is going to, and this is click to follow. Well, the link here is HTTP www.paypal.com. Huh, it's going to PayPal, right? Not so fast. The real domain, just keep looking here, there's a dot after the paypal.com, and here's some garbage, more than likely just to throw you off, but here's the real domain name, a31b6sf blah 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 dot com. That's the domain name. The rest is simply there to throw you off. And since they own the domain, they can put that word PayPal in there and .com and everything else. And then the CGI bin, web screen, blah, 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 blah yada, yada. Essentially, it's just a script that, you're, that they're going to fire off, plug in your email address, and try to get you to log in like you're logging into PayPal, and they're going to snag your password. And then what they're going to do is they're going to go to the real PayPal, log in as you, and probably try to clean out your account, maybe even a bank account or credit card that's attached. And then at the end, I don't know if this is, again, to throw you off or if it means anything on their end, but it says login processing equal OK. You know, maybe it's just something to make it look like it's legit, and it is not. All this squirrely garbage, I think in my mind, they could have come up with something a little bit better than that. But uh, nonetheless, a lot of people won't look at that or won't look any farther than PayPal.com. Another little clue here is HTTP colon. PayPal would use HTTPS colon, which would be the finance slash banking uh, more secure uh, internet protocol to access their site with. So a lot of clues here, and you don't have to see all of them to decide it's a scam. Uh, please don't click on anything like that. Like I say, you don't even need to open it, especially with Outlook. Now you may be a little bit safer in an environment like Gmail or something, 
uh, they're very likely, I didn't try it, but they're very likely to even maybe to pull up a prompt if you try to click and say, hey, are you sure? But uh, we, we, we really want to avoid malware on your computer. It's a lot easier to stop it from getting it in than it is to clean it once it's there. So hope this uh, little video has been uh, helpful to you. I did put all this in a blog post as well with a little bit of additional information. There'll be a, a link in the description of the video. You just click on that, go to my website and see that. Also appreciate if you would subscribe to my channel and then when new videos like this come out, you'll get uh, an alert that the, uh, the, the video is ready and hopefully it will be helpful too. So appreciate you watching. PCRoger.com. Hope to see you there. Thanks.